Hello, you guys. Hey for the collective. Hey for the collective. Let me see whose signs pulls out. Hey for the collective. My Pisces. For the collective. Oh, what? My Capricorn. Pisces, Capricorn. A Leo. Who else did it? A Libra. An Aquarius. And a Sagittarius. Okay, so that's whose energy. Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Leo, Capricorn, Pisces. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Welcome to Pound Star Oracle. I'm Pam. Nice to meet you. Hope I can help you guys. Um, so I did this for the whole collective. I pulled out a card from my big deck that's got a lot of information from things I've had to endure in my life or things, you know, that's happened to me. That helps with the collective. And, and I put a little message on top of the big message, okay? So let's get into it. So here's what it's saying. It says, um, somebody out here, you need to give yourself time to be single and alone and get to know what you truly want for yourself. That's for somebody. And it says, don't worry about what others will say about you. Do the right thing and be honest to to yourself and your and, and to your love. So you, you gotta you just gotta be honest. If you're in love with somebody and you're in a relationship, you need to become single. So I guess you can come together with your love. And it said, we're meant to rule the world together, baby. We've done this in our past lives together because we were royalty. We're royalty, baby. And it says. A reveal is getting ready to happen, and they're going to be confessing their love to you. It's coming out here for somebody up here. If this is your signs, it's coming to you, baby. Somebody's somebody's getting some love. That's what it's saying. Or if you got a lot of this in your birth chart, if you got more of something than your regular sun sign, like if you got a lot of Pisces or a lot of Capricorn or a lot of Libra and a lot of Leo or a lot of Aquarius or a lot of Sagittarius, it's coming to you. Are you listening? And somebody says you only live once. And two, 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 and grow up, Buttercup. Ooh, well, you got a spiritual partner you're coming together with. And this tarot reader got paid to do magic on you. Whoever this is, whoever this tarot reader is, that got paid to do magic on you. They, you never know what you're going to get in life. Oh, something's going to be coming back to this tarot reader that paid magic. That was paid to do magic on you. And over here, it says. Uh, your finances is going to increase tremendously. Look, you're going to get a big fat stack from when someone's grandpa passes away out here. Or you've been fighting over money. Somebody is that's watching me. I don't know you all, but this is energy that's pulling out from my collective. So I know some of this pertains to some of you all. It's in my collective. And it says, uh, this man fantasizes about getting you in bed that could be a dad too but like they're a grandfather do you understand that pies away but it could be like a dad of yours too but they're actually a grandpa you understand what i'm saying uh and this man fantasizes about getting you in the bed and all the things he wants to do to you now he's a smooth operator whoever this is now he's going to try to smooth you over now baby and it said they, some guy that has a disease out here, he's scared to tell his partner. And they're getting ready to be raid to rest. They're getting ready to die. That might be where you're getting this money from. Okay? Somebody in my collective. And, and it says, um, people doesn't understand that God will bring you to your twin. And it's all in God's timing, divine timing. So they can't block this. People that wants to block this... They're sad y'all ain't come together and they want to live with you now. See? 411. That's what that means right there. That's all divine timing. And your twin knows this. And maybe they know it. Someone's partner out here is getting ready to pass away. Whoever is going for now. You all just got to take it as it is. And, oh, when divine feminine wants to make you a good meal and run a warm bath and play around in a bathtub now with you divine masculine and give you the best night of your life, she said now. And she said, only smart people, please, divine masculine. Only a smart divine masculine. That's what that said. <laughs> I thought that was funny, don't you all? It's funny how spirit does this. It's funny how spirit showed me how to do that, okay? Oh, and you can't stop and block what God granted for me and my collective. They can't. These people that tries to block it in the tarot community, they can't. And, you know, snitches wind up in 
wind up dead and in the damn ditches. Oh, that's what happened to snitches, okay? So somebody that's a snitch, they're mad because uh, you live your life. You know, you only live once. You live life to the fullest. They're mad at you. And it says, dark energy is being sent to you for some dark spiritual sanitarial community. See, they're sending that. They're sending black magic to you. I love you, spirit. How you just showed everybody this. Look how spirit ch -ch -ch shit it out to put it on this card. Ain't it funny how we love spirit over here? Me and my Clinton, we love spirit how it tells. Huh. And wait till you see this, and this is the funniest of all, you guys. This devil worshippers trying to get you fall in love with him. They got a curse over their soul. So you don't have to worry about this person. This person needs to worry about getting that devil, that devil worshiping spirit off of their soul, okay? And, um, it says, why would somebody want to make you go homeless? God will get them people. And it's a porn star slut wannabe that wanted to make somebody homeless out here. So it's just some old porn star slut wannabe. They wanted to make pornos, I guess. They wanted to make you be homeless. That's stupid. That's how it laid out. So that's for somebody. And if people F with you, and people in my collective, if they mess with you, they're going to receive karma a thousand fold because spirit guides will come and get them for it. They're going to come get them for you. So don't worry, you're all spirit guides, Will 622. Hey, y'all don't tread on me. You know, I guess that, uh, that uh, tag, don't tread on me with that snake. These people that tread on you, they're receiving their karma. It's funny. They're, it's funny that these tarot people that did this, they're receiving their karma. And it's coming out in real time so you can see that I'm true. And I'm not a, I'm not a liar and I'm not against any of these people, but they show that they're against us and my collective. Oh, and it's all right. We're not talking about them. Uh, they, they'll get their they'll get their karma. And these dudes that's getting paid by older men to come and spy on your ass every time you go out, they are stalking and gawking. They got paid to do it. And this shit was a damn disaster for them. There's a disaster because they can't they can't get you doing something crazy because you're because you're not doing nothing crazy. That's why. And because you're living in your Nord node, you're moving towards the past, and you can reflect on your. In your south node, you can reflect over things that you've done in your past. And you're living large and feeling in charge. Ooh, good for you, babies. Good for you guys. And what you give is what you're going to receive. Boy, ain't that true. What you give is what you're going to get. And never forget where you come from, guys. When you make it big, never forget where you come from and the people that helped you along the way. And make, make for clear and short to listen to what I'm telling you. Never forget where you come from. And, um, oh, I like this one. Look, make a wish, and it's granted. It says the stars brought you together to shine for all to see. Don't you love that? Don't you love my good readings for my collective? I love you, my good collective. You all going to get your wishes because you all wished on a star, both of you all did. And, uh, you know, some of us, we don't have nothing to worry about because we didn't do none of this dumb, stupid shit that all these other people did, and we ain't worried, honey. And you can concur. Somebody can concur with me. We're not worried about all these spells and shit. We're not worried about it. We didn't do nothing to these people, so don't worry about it. And uh, these people need to learn that you can't believe everything that one person tells you just because it's somebody that you trust because maybe they're a damn liar or a druggie and they might drive a Chevy Silverado. That might be for somebody out here. That this person believes everybody else over you. Like if they tell that you did something, it's some bitch. They'll believe everybody but you. No, I don't like people like that, do you? When I tell you something, better be down believe it. Oh, and, uh, you know, when it's the planets are in retrograde and they're going backwards, uh, challenges can and will occur, and it will create positive or negative results. And they got paid to do this black magic. His tarot reader got paid to do black magic on you from his devil worshiper. It could be a partner of yours, his devil worshiper partner. They paid them to do this during Mercury Retrograde, and that started May the 10th of 22 this year. I don't, we're in Mercury, you know, that's the planet Virgo is from. It's Virgo season. Happy birthday. 919, 919 is my husband's birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, you need to clean it, clean your crystals and cards today, you guys. And uh, because they're trying to uh, send negative energy towards you. And right here, somebody is getting thumbs down on your videos, and uh, they might think that you hate them. It could be your man that thinks you hate them, and uh, and 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 uh, your spouse is cheating. Their spouse is cheating. Whoever's thumbs down your videos, their their spouse is cheating, and they think you did something. 
like, uh, like, you know, I'm a turtle rear. They think that I personally did something to them, and I don't even know them. You know what I'm saying? And their spouse is cheating, and they're mad, and they want to thumbs down my videos. That's what I mean. And you're off. And uh, it says, confess to yourself all your wrongdoings and shady dealings so you can grow into the good person you're meant to meant to be. Yeah, that's like when, you know, you're going through a dark night of soul and you pray for forgiveness. And you might even read the Bible and you might have had the Holy Ghost uh, in spirit in you. And you told all your wrongs and uh, you're good with it. And, and, and the universe appreciates you. And some mom out here, they didn't give him uh, the correct way of loving like she should have done. So they, some mom out here needs to confess to her son that she didn't give di didn't give him the love in the correct way and that's what she turned her son into a narcissist and a real good boy but turned him into a narcissist because she didn't give him the correct love and uh this person all they did is sit back and lie and run your name through the dirt and the ringer now that you're healing they want to come back around in your energy because you're showing leadership that's the only reason don't let them back because that you're going to receive karma because they got paid to do shit on you from might have been a partner out here somebody's partner might have a disease and they're not even telling you or you know like uh, uh illness not it doesn't have to be a disease like they could have cancer or something they're not telling you but somebody is getting ready to receive money from a death because that's why that come out that d deceased grandpa and you might be receiving a large inheritance but these people that cast it confusion and illusion spells on you and put you in brain fog and making you feel something all it did is uh, set you down and maybe a practice like I'm doing to make you be proud of all your successes. It made you, uh, all that brain frog helped you come alive. That's what it means. You start living in your north node. Stop worrying about the south node, you know. And You know, it's your destiny. It's not theirs to mess with. Think about it. It's it, These people that tries to mess with your destiny, they can't. And this someone's deceased dad out here is helping with your destiny. Someone's deceased dad is helping with your destiny. Are you listening? And it says right here, member, member buries for South Park. Oh, I remember, I remember, I remember back in the time, 12, 12. And giants can't even hurt you. You win against them. So you're remembering that you fought some even big tough men, ain't you? You're remembering it and secrets is coming out and it will help you to move forward with your life. That's what they're remembering right now. Somebody out here that you're moving forward with your life. That's what it meant. Uh, that's crazy. Be proud of your successes. You're a leader. You're helping these moms that didn't raise their kids the correct way. You're t telling them all they got to do is apologize and, and uh, forgive their self. And this shit was a damn disaster when they paid these people. You're just feeling, you're living large and feeling in charge, it said. And never forget where you came from. Clean and clear your crystals today. Somebody's spouse is cheating and they got a curse over their soul from this devil worshiper. And never, they never, they, they, they're never going to know what they're going to get in their life from all this black magic they used. And the stars brought you to your twin, your twin flame or twin ray. The stars brought you to them and snitches wind up in ditches. Somebody's going to be confessing to you and it's somebody that you, you, you lived in a past life together. You all was royalty and maybe you've linked it and they love you. That's what it means. They love you big. And don't worry about what others say, deceased grandpa said. They're just porn star wannabe sluts and only smart people, please. That's what we want. Only smart people. And uh, your your twin flame or twin ray is sad that y'all ain't come together yet, and he wants to be a smooth operator and talk to you finally whenever this person is laid to rest. That's what it said, okay? I ain't been putting a little stack of cards back in the same stack, so my readings will be uh, make sense, or you know what I'm saying, you guys. I hope y'all like how I'm doing. Somebody needs to grow up, though. That's what that card also, that other card said. They need to grow up. And, um, I got a new tarot deck today, and it's real cute, you guys. And, uh, do you want me to go get it? Hang on. I'm gonna go get it. I ain't never used it. Hang on.
I've been so excited about it, you all. I've been so excited to show you. Oh, I've been so excited. Look what it is. It's Garbage Pail Kids. You remember them, uh, you remember them Garbage Pail cards when we was growing up in the 80s? And they had like pukey cards like bah! and they'd puke and be gross looking. Look, look at Hangman. <laughs> I'll show you in a minute. But that's what it is. I need to uh, shuffle them real good. Hang on. Need to shuffle them real good. I thought this might make somebody happy. Make their day today anyways. Hopefully it make you happy. It made me happy. 1533. It made me happy. Alright. Spirit can you give us a message for the collective? Okay, okay. Can you give us a message? Okay, hang on. Spirit. What are seven of ones? What are seven of ones? What under ten of cups? Oh, these are so cool. Wait till you see them. Wait till you see them. Wait till you see them. And I love them so much. And I hope y'all love them as much as I do. And looky here. Here is seven of wands. Look at that little chubby one. I'm going to write on the back of them the, the, their names. Because they all have names. And I'm going to write on it. And, and tell you kind of what it means in this deck. You know. But you had to uh, stand up. For yourself see how you're standing up against these people coming at you this these little aliens and these things up here you're standing up and you're like no i'm standing up for my darn beliefs and what i believe and i'll i can overcome all these challenges i ain't scared oh look and in four swords you had to rest and recoup uh, look that's the vampire one see I me mean, these little vampire uh i mean these little coffin so you had to uh stand up to uh could have been a vampire narcissist bully, you know, since that's a little vampire uh, garbage pill kid. But you had to rest and recharge it, or and uh, you had to lay to rest these old ways, is what it is. And the emperor came out, and I love this because right over here on top is the empress. So the emperor come out, and you know, you're being seen as a loyal, loving, dedicated man that works hard for the things you want and uh you're just going after your goals you got the keys to all kingdom baby you're the emperor and uh and it's just like your mind is exploding all this this knowledge of wealth that you got inside of you see how his mind is exploding and his emperor crown is on top it's just everybody's seeing it baby everybody's seeing you become the leader that you're meant to be emperor and we love you that's what divine feminine says Oh, and the hangman just got illuminated to you. Look at its eyeballs. <laughs> I love these. If y'all love them, hit like. 
all of you need to hit like nowadays to help me get the damn video around. And please hit like so I can keep showing us these cool cards and get around. And, and I thank you to my husband for buying my new cool cards. I love them. And so this got illuminated to you that uh, maybe you was caught up. You was caught up. You was caught up in your head over this emperor. That's why that emperor's head's exploding. This got illuminated to you. You're in love with this emperor. This emperor's in love with you. It become illuminated. Yeah, because look, they want to have a ten of cups live with you. Look, they see you as a uh, as being wish fulfillment, and that you all could just get anything done in your life, and and they love you, and they appreciate you what you've taught them, and. They want, they want, they see you as marriage, you know, and, and you all will be balanced in this. I love spirit. Do y'all love spirit? Temperance. Temperance angel come out and, uh, uh, you're just loving life and, and, uh, the angels has blessed you to be balanced in your, uh, life and in your love life, at, in your home life. If you're married, you're balanced and. And, you know, the angels helped you do this, is what I think. And Nine of Cups, you're all wish fulfillment. Look, how much more do you need? Emperor loves you. Look, Emperor loves you, Empress. There's Empress. See her? And I think her name was Hippie something. <laughs> it was. It was a happy hippie. <laughs> happy hippie. I can't remember what Emperor said, but I'm going to write the names on it, what it says now, you guys. And, uh, but my granddaughter's coming over, and I got to help of her in a minute but somebody wants to see you as wish fulfillment and just you know they they love you you're a joy to be around look this is a fly look it's a fly one <laughs> uh you can turn trash into gold that's what it's saying now by georgie that's what it said and knight of cups you're getting ready to receive an offer of love somebody wants to bring an offer of love to you baby they're coming in fast. They're on their ship and they're headed towards you right now as we mom, uh, as we speak. That's a pirate coming now, what I just said. And and then here we got Eight of Cups. Um, somebody turned and walked away from a certain situation. You turned and walked away from a certain situation that, that you didn't feel like you was... Um, or you might have left like drug life behind or something. It can also be saying that, you know, and that's the truth. What I just said, you, you, you learned how to walk away from people that didn't give you any good love. And that's great. And seven of coins come out. You're finally seeing seeds. You're, you're getting ready to harvest the crop. You know, you, you've been working on your business, uh, seven of pentacles and, and you know, it's growing at the moment. You're my, be get ready to receive some money and then we got king of cups oh guys somebody wants to uh somebody's hiding their emotions for you cancer scorpio or pisces they somebody around hiding their emotions for you and uh they want to speak their truth to you and it's this emperor because he loves you and he just he wants to show you how much that he cares for you he wants to take you out on a moonlight ride and you all just come together and with your all's ideas of family and what family life means to you they're wanting to discuss this at the moment now that's what it is now trust me and then here we have uh the hermit oh maybe it's king of cups they're going inside at the moment they're going inside and they're hermiting and they're going to be uh figuring out they're going to go through that dark night of soul they're going to clean up clean up all them old cobwebs that's inside their brain see and stop focus on it and that's what they're doing and death they went they're they're going through a uh death and rebirth they're coming out a new little baby that's what it means see how that little grim reaper's on top of that flower <laughs> but uh yeah they're um they're getting resurrected into this new person during hermiting and you taught them this. That's why sort of truth come out. You taught them how to become you. You, the emperor says, thank you for standing up and going inside and cleaning yourself up for me. My head's about to explode all this knowledge of where we came from. You're making me be aware of it. It's totally aware. My mind's about to explode. That we had a family back long ago, and we're back. And, and, and or I mean if you're all together you're all balanced and this emperor loves you so much and you're all just wish fulfillment for each other 
you know, and uh, love is coming to you because you walked away from somebody that didn't love you. That's the truth, and that's why your business is growing and you're receiving all this love because you went inside and done the healing and to show up as a new person on the outside. I love spirit. Do y'all love spirit as much as me? And do you love my pretty cards as much as me? And if you do, hit subscribe, you guys, because this is my favorite deck that I ever got, and I love it. And I thank you for it, Spirit, and I thank you for it. And it wasn't that high, you guys. It wasn't that high. But it's garbage pill kids ones, okay? If, you, if you're if you interested in it. And I got the book on it. Seeing, like, some of them's names, like, Knight of Coins, that means Horsey Henry. <laughs> or Page of Coins means Vendo Matt. See why I got to go through and write what it means? And Temperance is Balanced to Betty. <laughs> Let's see what story is. Hang on. Your story is this right here, I think. Or star, hang on. The devil is cranky Frankie and hot Scott. <laughs> the tower is cracked Jack. Oh, and the star is hopeful Hedda. Hopeful Hedda. Hopeful Hedda. <laughs> That's funny, ain't it? Well, I just wanted to show y'all that. Let me give you something else with these. One more message. I thought my son was bringing my granddaughter back, but I still ain't seen him. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. Spirit, what's your message for the people today? I love y'all, and I thank you, and I hope y'all like the way I'm doing things a little different now. Let me lay a story out so I can read it to y'all, okay? Yeah, yeah, what else, what else, what else? Oh, Spirit, you're fast. You're so fast. Wow, is that what it is? Oh, what else? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, what under my chore, man? Oh, wow, okay. What under fourth house? Okay. What under eighth? Oh, well, wowdy woody. What about lovers? What about if? Oh, wow, is that what it is? Alright, so what it's saying is there's a mature man out here, someone that's older, uh, you know, and wise, and they've lived a long time. They might have a lot of knowledge, and they've traveled the world since I see the globe there. they got a lot of knowledge, and um, it could be a Sagittarius that's paying attention to you, and uh, or maybe it's just a mature man that's in the spiritual community, and... Um, He's listening to your philosophies and the laws involved and the way you do things in a big way. Uh, this is about your spiritual values and your long-range thinking of travel. What is to be shared? So you are getting ready to share your spiritual values with this mature man as you used to do in the past. So this might be somebody that you, you actually know and you haven't seen them in a long time and you're all getting ready to connect. And, and it could be someone that um it says your home base or your family it could be a mature man in your family or they're wanting to make a family with you because they feel secure with you as mature man does and and they want to be with you because you make them feel secure and they feel support with you you know this is your home family base and they're wanting to court you they want to take you out on the town and and show you how much they appreciate you you know and and then the eighth house come out, you know, and this is Scorpio, and that fourth house is Cancer, ninth is Sagittarius, and this is a, uh, uh, you are getting and using your power, or somebody is using other people's resources, uh, this is a life or death issue, something about a life or death issue with this mature man, this is about your personal power in the mysteries of life. A major change. That's what it is. A major change of sudden wealth. That's why you see 11 11 all the time. Oh, I love you for that, Spirit. Oh, I love you. <coughs> or, or maybe you're seeing two numbers added together a lot. Like two numbers and two numbers, which adds up to be 11 11. And Spirit said, oh, you're so special. And, and you got a loving connection. Somebody loves you big, and they want to just be with you. 29, 29, 11, 11. Ours are sudden wealth is coming to us, baby. Oh, I love you. And somebody's out here is feeling despair in their love life. I don't know who this is, you guys. I have no clue, but they're feeling like um, down on their luck with 
with their uh, person at the moment. And somebody's getting ready to receive a gift. Oh, wow. And my son passed away at 17. Every time I see this, I think I'm going to get a new spiritual a spiritual gift. And I thank you for that spirit. And it could be you're getting ready to receive a gift, Aquarius, 11th house. Uh, you're, uh, you're, you're receiving this gift for humanity's sake. That's why you're getting ready to receive it. This is about your hopes and wishes. And remember earlier, it's like your wishes will be granted. Ain't that what it said? Because you all was meant to come together. Didn't it say uh, the stars brought you together? Remember? That's what it said earlier. I don't see. Because you're supposed to do it for the the help of the future of humanity. That's why. This is about your freedom and association. Your circle of friends. So maybe your friends is getting ready to give you a gift. Um, Aquarius. And and uh, the gift is... tell. Uh, they're telling you that they're going to move you away from a poverty life, maybe, for someone out here. Or maybe poverty is coming to some Leo out here. Maybe it's Leo did some black magic against you in the spiritual community or something like that. Remember it said that? That might be who that trial reader is. Because uh, they was trying to make... that. Because this person doesn't have self-confidence to create... They was taking a chance on doing that black magic. Now they're going to be left out in poverty. Yeah, resulting from their fucking actions. And this is about leadership and your creativeness. You're not going to be poor, but this person that put poverty on you is... Poverty's coming back to them. Yeah, they're, they're getting ready to have a big change. A big change. This person that tried to steal your wealth. A big change. Who's getting ready to have? Who's getting ready to have to have a big change? Who is that spirit? Who's getting ready to have, to have a big change? Oh, it's wealthy man. So a wealthy man's getting ready to be poor. That's what it is. This wealthy man in this community, he's gonna to have to be poor for whatever he freaking did to us. He did something to somebody in the community now, and it could be spiritual or your real actual life that is messing with your life and this mature man has seen it all and, and they support you and they know that you're getting ready to have personal power and a lot of wealth you and your lover and this person over here this person that poverty's coming to this Leo that is a wealthy man they're going to be in despair because they're going to probably have to change and go to ice way to jail for messing with uh, you uh, Aquarius and trying to steal your gifts. That's what it meant. Oh, that's all it meant, you guys. That's all it meant. That's all it meant. And I, I'm going to leave it at that, you all, because it's already so late. Let me give you one little one little message. Oh, you have an intense bond. The intensity of a true soul connection includes great highs and great lows. Boy, that's true. Sometimes you'll want to just bust a damn wind out with them. Sometimes they'll get you pissed off. But you know what? That's what true love is. And that's what a true bond. A love bond grows stronger over time. Boy, that's true. I've been together with my old man 22 years. So, I mean, we got a really intense bond with each other. And uh, I love y'all. And maybe you all see 1111 a lot. Oh, see 1111. There's another sign. Sun Wealth is coming to you, baby. How much more do you need? And I love y'all. Go ahead and hit subscribe if you watched all the way through. And I appreciate you guys. And go ahead and hit like to my collective. I love you and I thank you. And you can leave me a comment. And I appreciate them. And I love you. And peace.